Scientists across the globe agree human activity continues to put unprecedented amounts of damaging greenhouse gases into the Earth's atmosphere. Gases like carbon dioxide and methane trap the sun's heat just like in a greenhouse. The planet can't stay at a stable temperature and the increasing heat energy is making our climate more volatile and unpredictable. We're already seeing wetter, warmer winters and warmer, drier summers. We're experiencing flooding, wildfires, rising sea levels and life-threatening heat waves. Our planet is facing the greatest threat in thousands of years. We need to act now to limit the severity of climate change. That's why we are working to reduce our carbon footprint and promoting sustainability actions in communities and businesses across the borough, reducing the impact of climate change and protecting the future of Cheshire East. Around the world, governments and organisations are working out how to achieve carbon neutrality. But what does carbon neutral actually mean in practice? Well, it's about making sure we reduce carbon emissions as far as possible. Any emissions that can't be reduced can be offset. So, for example, planting carbon-absorbing trees can make up for that carbon we can't avoid using. Over many ages, the Earth has stored carbon in various ways, as coal, oil and gas, or in huge forests like the Amazon and vast peatlands. The problem is human activities have released fossilised carbon that has been locked away for millions of years in just two centuries or so. And the last few decades have seen a dramatic increase in that process. At the same time, millions of hectares of carbon-storing forest and other habitats have been destroyed. So people, governments and organisations across the globe need to act right now. With this in mind, here's how we intend to reduce our own carbon emissions. We're making our buildings more energy efficient. We're electrifying our vehicle fleet and encouraging the use of car sharing, pool cars and bikes. We have introduced hydrogen-powered refuse vehicles, the first of their kind in the Northwest, bringing environmental and air quality benefits to the borough. And naturally, we're committed to adopting green fuel sources like solar, heat pumps and green electricity. We're increasing online meetings and working from home more often, reducing the emissions caused by commuting. In our communities, we're taking steps to enable more sustainable travel, such as walking, cycling and public transport. We're also planting many more trees and restoring peatland because these habitats have the potential to absorb large amounts of carbon in the coming years. Throughout the Council, we're training and educating ourselves to think green. So the decisions we make always prioritise sustainability. That includes encouraging our suppliers to work with us to tackle climate change. And it's great to see that the people of Cheshire East are coming together to help too. We're working with our partners, schools, town and parish councils, businesses and residents to highlight the climate challenge and to support actions that reduce emissions across the borough. We're all in this together, and together we can make changes that make a difference. If you'd like to know more about how we are working to reduce carbon emissions, visit our website to find out more.